Prince Harry's hopes of reconciliation with his father, King Charles III, have been dashed. According to royal experts, the Duke of Sussex was under the impression that the king would forgive him and make amends for the perceived hurt he has suffered. However, the plan has backfired, and the distance between the two remains as large as ever, with no signs of a reunion on the horizon. The rift between the father and son has only deepened in recent years, with Harry and his wife, Meghan Markle, making a series of explosive revelations about the royal family. From the Oprah Winfrey interview to the Netflix documentary in Harry's memoir, Spare, the couple's criticisms have only served to widen the division. The king, who is said to be filled with horror at the prospect of Harry and Meghan's potential memoir, is reportedly privately furious with his son's actions. The monarch is said to expect an apology from Harry, while the Duke and Duchess believe the royal family should be the ones to make the first move and say sorry. Adding to the tension, the king is said to be refusing to take calls from his son, a clear indication of the depth of his anger. The sovereign is also reportedly furious that Harry is refusing to bring his grandchildren, Archie and Lilibet, to the UK, further straining the already fragile relationship. For Harry, the realization that his father is unwilling to forgive him and make amends has been a devastating blow. The royal expert Tom Quinn reveals that despite all his criticisms, Harry always assumed he would be forgiven by his father. He thought Charles would make amends for the hurt that in Harry's view justified the criticisms. With the reconciliation seemingly out of reach, the future of the relationship between the King and the Duke of Sussex appears bleak. The High Court's recent ruling against Harry's challenge to the decision to downgrade his taxpayer-funded police protection has only added to his woes, as experts predict he will travel alone to the Invictus Games in Birmingham in 2027. As the rift between the Sussexes and the royal family continues to deepen, the question remains. Will the wounds ever heal, or will the divide between father and son remain a permanent scar on the House of Windsor? Thanks for watching, make sure to subscribe and turn on notifications for more of the same. See you soon.